we should be able to out climb this guy, right? Does, does this guy have missiles? Please don't have missiles. I really, I really don't truly know. Oh no. Oh. What happened right there, boys, was a good old give War Thunder money for fun maneuver. Oh. What happened right there, boys, was a good old give War Thunder money for fun maneuver. Okay, this seems like a very good way to have fun in War Thunder for a new player. No missiles! A Seahawk just killed our friendly meteor. Bacon says, missiles, bro, my bad. <laughs> Guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for the support last video. Like, what? Guys, what is wrong with y'all? What is. Guys, that video yesterday, Monday, took me 28 minutes and 20 seconds to fully complete. It was a fun joke video. I was expecting, ha ha ha, fly. That's very funny. It got 100,000 views in two hours. My most planned, my most time-consuming, my most edited videos on this channel have never done that well. Ever. So, with that said, um, maybe this week or next week, we're going to continue Tutorial Daily and maybe complete the motorboat tutorial for everybody. <laughs> uh, by the way, I'm still nasally, so apologies. Uh, what we're doing today, though... Oh, by the way, guys... Um, War Thunder, it's almost fun. Sure, might happen. It might happen. A lot of people seem to have been behind it. War Thunder, it's almost fun. Let me know even more if you guys would like to see that. I just want to see if it's if, if it's worth everybody's time. So War Thunder's been out for, for quite a long time. And one of the one of the best jets, air quotes, you could have had back in 2012 was the ME163. It was kind of cream of the crop. And back in that day, Air RB wasn't really a thing. It was Air Arcade. And this thing used to face biplanes, Chaikas. I have, I have literal proof of it. If you guys are worried about balance now, you guys should have seen it back in the day. Boomer as f Am I right, guys? Am I right? Okay, but what I'm trying to get at is that this game, or this vehicle the me163 has been in the game forever and war thunder has never given it a proper engine sound now i'm not saying mine's proper but it's not a jet engine this is a i want to say it's a liquid engine a liquid rocket rocket engine there is two fuels and you guys are my intelligent brain cells down below i'm just here for moral support very uh flammable very corrosive very uh, what's the word? Toxic chemicals that would mix. Boom! Make a rocket. But all I'm saying is that they haven't added a a rocket sounding effect. And thanks to Gentle Spy, today we have that. And if you guys want to download that for yourself, it's in the description below. We're going to wait until these jet plebs have clear. What in the world? What are you doing? Just to get the best sound possible. And guys, I know what you're thinking. No, this is not an excuse to play the 163 today. This is just an enhancement. And speaking of playing the 163, I haven't played this plane in probably about two years, maybe a year and a half. Ever since they added the ME163 with the 20 mils, I haven't touched this one. Or I haven't touched it. And speaking of that, if, if we aren't doing too well in this one, we'll probably switch to the 20 millimeter one just because it's a lot easier to aim. Okay, rocket engine on. Hold the brakes. Let it get a little bit. Yes. So, in startup, it's got this little girthy sound. I'll be quiet. But then... Isn't that lovely? Now, I don't know how realistic it is, but it's a lot cooler than the default jet sound it has. Okay, now, how do I play this thing? So many new planes and things and objects. This is the OG. This thing has been around 
forever. And uh, I would, I'm not even gonna talk about being rusty because I'm not. I've been playing this thing for eight years. Got an FJ down here doing ballerina stuff. F2H. I can do this, guys. No head on, though. I don't want to do head on. I've got a lot of climb potential to this. Uh, oh, God. Good Lord. Am I going for that meteor? Guys, it's cool. It's cool. I'm okay still. Blackbird. Well done, kind sir. A little, a little rough start, but uh, I really enjoyed that sound bite right there. That that actually kind of made my day. I haven't had that sound bite at a more perfect time yet. Like seriously trying to evade this meteor. <laughs> like I was full concentration. I was looking at what the meteor was doing, what I used to do to counter what he was doing to throw off his pipper. <laughs> I've never seen this before. This, is this new? I mean, granted, I haven't played this thing forever, but that's a really cool interior. They have the ammo stored right on top of the fuel cell. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, we got four minutes of fuel left. Okay, this guy, does he want to go for me? No, I think he's going to head on. Oh, Shiza, he has that, you know what? Flaps can come out? Nice. The getting closer to victory. This guy seems like a runner. He's got those S21s that don't really work as well as they did. Okay, we're gonna idle and kind of hawk a little bit. Let our speed carry us towards him without burning too much fuel. Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. See the spool down? Where it really should be like that, boom. This is my favorite part with the 163, just hawking like this. You don't really get this experience with many other planes in the game because you don't have to really conserve your fuel like this. And then before someone types key 200, yeah, 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 yeah. How do I help them? Might be able to take out one, but we gotta go after that. Oh, dang it. That was a really cool shot, though. Okay, we're using the time old strategy of let your team do all the work and you come in and clean up. This is called the vulture strategy. It's probably my favorite. No works involved. You just kind of go into the middle and brr, brr, brr. Okay. Good. Now 
The LA-200 is a very fast aircraft, but I think I've caught him. But all he has to do really is go into a dive. But now let's not rip again. Good critical. No rip that time. Oh, almost ripped right there. I think it... Oh, man. That sounded wonderful. LA-200, I think, is in a... Yeah, he's not... He's going to get cleaned up there, here. We might be able to clinch our kill. Let's see if we can do that. That'd be cool. Oh, this is gonna be. This is gonna. <laughs> Sick, dude. <laughs> War Thunder. It's almost fun. <laughs> We should be able to outclimb this guy, right? Does does this guy have missiles? Please don't have missiles. I really, I really don't truly really know. Okay, there goes his energy. I'm gonna turn on this, right? Oh no! Oh, mission protocol number three or two: stay alive, survive. What happened right there, boys, was a good old give War Thunder money for fun maneuver. I was like, I, I think that's the, I think that's the sea, the sea thing that has the, the missile. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna stall climb here and lock you up here. I, the missile's out. I'm already dead. Oh, what the? What is this? What is that? Is that a Chinese IL-28? <laughs> H5, perfect name, China. Not ZTZ59448889. Let's get, let's lower some of this fuel. I don't really want to go after that guy just because of, you know what? Okay, here we go. Yes, around, around 800 and below is like a perfect maneuvering speed for uh, the ME-163. Okay. <clears throat> What's going on? What's going on? Oh wow, his worked! Sick! Yeah, you're welcome, Zella. That was a that, that was a sick shot. I'm glad that your rounds are working. Oh. What's up, dude? <laughs> okay, so we've uh, we've changed aircrafts. We're in the uh, ME163 with the with the 420s. Yo, my engine's louder. Can't even hear yours. All right, up we go. 30 degree climb. This time we should expect to kill stuff that we're behind and, or just at least hit something, you know? I mean, we'll probably spark two with this. Man, I feel like I'm in a different war scenario right now. I'm not too sure what it is, but I definitely don't feel like I'm in World War II. God, that takeoff really drains your fuel and your climb potential. F-86s are going to be hard cakes to take down. They truly are. Okay, we'll start going slower speed here. Okay, game plan, G-91. Or just make 15. Let's boost. No missiles! A Seahawk just killed our friendly meteor. Oh my goods. Okay, we're away though. We got three minutes of fuel left. More power, more power, baby. Bacon and the Seahawk just killed our meteor who... What is going on here? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go F2 agent if I possibly can here. Nice, good. Good. 
good. Up we go. It's fuel, fuel, bingo. Okay, good. Our, our, our fast jets are going to be chasing him now. Okay, we can kind of glide over here. We got 2 minutes and 25 seconds of fuel. Please do not shoot me ground anti-air. Hmm. Well, we're gonna need some speed. Now. A lot of speed. This guy, I don't really know if I should go for. It looks like he's already kind of suiciding into the enemy team, or our team. And then their teams, I don't know if that's like proper anti-air. I'm going to assume it is. Okay, G91, we're bingo, super bingo on fuel. Flaps can come out maybe? Nope. But we're good here, I think. Those flaps out. Worth it. God, the 163 still goes hard. One guy left. Put more on the enemy. See, <laughs> Bacon says, missiles, bro, my bad. <laughs> let's say he's let's say he's still alive. Soon. Oh. Okay, there we go. Cool. Consensus? Uh, this is a much better 163, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video today, uh, today with the rocket sounds. Link description below. Again, let me know more about that t-shirt. <laughs> we literally had to switch planes today because, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day. Peace out.